Dear students, today we will discuss one more drug that is Mebendazole. Mebendazole basically belongs to anthelmintic category. As we have discussed in the classification of Mebendazole, that belongs to which category? Uh, we would like to discuss the Mebendazole. That is Mebendazole. Okay. And Mebendazole belongs to anthelmintic in the classification. We have discussed in the heterocyclic. Heterocyclic have a benzimidazole means benzene is attached to the imidazole ring system. Okay, and uh, also it uh, have a carbamate nucle uh, functional group. How it is carbamate? How it is heterocyclic? How it is benzimidazole? We will discuss completely. Before going to the synthesis and structure of mebendazole, we would like to discuss the mechanism of action of mebendazole. Me in the mechanism of me uh, mebendazole, that is irreversibly block glucose uptake. As you know, the glucose is the main source of uh, energy for the each cell. So means uh, if there will be no glucose entry, if there is there is uh, is no glucose entry into the cell of any organism. Here we are discussing about the helminthic category means a parasite which is present in the human body. That is no entry of glucose which results depletes glycogen in parasites means. If there is no glucose entry into the cell, means what will happen? The glucose that glucose and that if there is no entry, no entry into the glucose, then glycogen present in the cell, which uh, is used as a storage form, then that, that glycogen is used to produce energy. Uh, at the same time, a particular uh, after the particular time, there is uh, no glucose, no gl glycogen because complete glycogen has been used by respective cell. What will happen? There is no availability of energy source means glucose. If there is no availability of glucose, glycogen, then uh, ultimately what will happen? Death of parasite. And this is our motto to death of parasite. Here, yeah? this is very simple. Uh, means um, if we will not give um, to food any person uh, after certain time, he will he will die. That that is a similar mechanism for the parasite also. Okay, the uses of parasite. Uh, sorry, uses of mebendazole that is basically broad spectrum helminthetic category that is belongs to suppose nematodes. Most of nematodes are treated. With mebendazole, that is whipworm, pinworm, roundworm, and hookworm. These are the different nematodes which uh, are um, present as a parasite in human body or GIT. Okay, mebendazole we will give to the respective person or patient, then uh, that, that is that nematodes and that that is whipworm, pinworm, roundworm and hookworm will be uh, expelled out uh, through uh, uh, fissure. Okay. Next one, it is a very important point that is a teratogenic drug. Teratogenic drug which uh, a drug which are in contraindicated in pregnancy because teratogenic drug cause abnormality in fetus. Okay. Means not given to the uh, in pregnancy or pregnant patient clear this is all about starting from mechanism uses and that is a contraindication that is teratogenic drug most of exams like that a competitive exam or multiple choice question based exam there is a question maybe that uh, which drug is teratogenic then, he, then that is mebendazole is the one of the drug which caused uh, abnormality in fetus okay this is uh, all about the related to pharmacological or short um, multiple choice questions. Now come to the synthesis. As per your PCA syllabus, uh, you have to remember or he, you have to learn the synthesis of mebendazole and then mebendazole uh, is synthesized in a very simple manner that is basically benzoyl form or we can say uh, that is what is that? Chloro uh, 
phenyl and this is the means uh, this is benzoyl form okay this is benzoyl derivative this is benzoyl derivative that benzoyl derivative uh, have a two benzene ring in benzene ring if we are treating the uh, concentrate H2, h2so4 and concentrate hno3 means mixture of both acids that mixture known as nitrating mixture what is that basically nitrating mixture it is known as nitrating mixer means it uh, cause nitration it cause nitration nitration that is that belongs to reaction number one means that reaction number one that is electrophilic electrophilic substitution reaction okay that is the example of nitration that means nitro group is introduced at this position similarly at the same time here we are treating with the ammonia means that is a um, only substitution reaction or we can say amidation that is second point second reaction this chloro group will be substituted by mean of ns2 means that is uh, i mean to say substitution reaction. Okay, substitution reaction. That is nitro. Uh, in, uh, that chloro group means removal of HCl. Here chlorine and here H as, as removed as HCl and similarly NH2 group. Clear? Now, in next stage, here nitro group. Here nitro group will uh, reduce to respective amino group. It is very simple as an HCl that is reducing reagent that is uh, simply third reaction that is reduction. Our nitro group is reduced to respective NS2 group. Okay, here we having we are having two NS2 group, and now if, uh, we are having a, a molecule which going to be condensed with the, this molecule. But what is this molecule and how we can prepare? See, this one is the vanadine form. Vanadine form uh, having a sulfide uh, sulfide form here, chlorine group. And H group H will be removed as a HCl and this nitrogen will get COCH3. This nitrogen will get COCH3. Okay. Then this is the side, uh, molecule which are which is going to be uh, condensed to this molecule. How it is condensed? Okay. Try to understand. Now the here NH2 group. Here uh, what is this? Here NH2 NH2 group. Then what will happen? Here, uh, this ammonia and the uh, sorry amino group and this amino, uh, ammonia amino group will remove as a NS3. Okay, then this carbon, this carbon will attach to this nitrogen. Means this that nitrogen uh, here, this nitrogen and this carbon attach to this here. And at the same time, this SH group, this SH group will remove, have hydrogen. That hydrogen have it, that is CH3SH, that is thiomethanol, that is thiomethanol have H and then that will be here uh, NH, clear? And this nitrogen as such will be here like this. Then NH form is this one, sheet OCH3. Then what is this molecule? This will, this ring system is bench imidazole. This is bench imidazole. Okay, and this uh, fourth reaction, very simple reaction that is, we can say cyclization as well as we can say that is condensation. That is condensation. Clear? Yeah? Then, the, what is this? Carboxylic group having an nitro uh, amino group that is uh, carbamate form. This is carbamate. And this drug out that is mependazole. Then I, I have uh, named the two um, points that the benzimidazole and carbamate. Benzimidazole and carbamate. See, this is the benzimidazole. What is the benzimidazole? 1, 2, 3, 4, 5, 6, 7. This is benzimidazole. Benzene having a imidazole ring system. Imidazole 1, uh, 5 membered ring. 5 membered ring containing. Um, 
टू नाइट्रोजन हैविंग वन थ्री पोजिशन वन एंड थ्री पोजिशन नोन एज बेन्जिमेटाजोल सॉरी इमेटाजोल एंड इमेटाजोल अटेज टू देंजिन दैट इज बेन्जिमेटाजोल दिस इज द नंबरिंग सिस्टम दिस एज आई हैव अर्लियर सेट दैट इज द बेन्जोल फॉर्म What is there? That is benzoyl form, and it is it is present in fifth position. It is present at fifth position means uh, C. This is carbamate. This is carbamate. Carbamate having methyl derivative. That is a methyl derivative. That is methyl and carbamate. This is methyl and carbamate. And um, this methyl carbamate is present on benzimidazole that is benzimidazole at which position at second position means two benzimidazole okay and that benzimidazole having uh, uh, a substitution where fifth position what is that benzoyl form that is the five benzoyl okay this is the ipc name of this mebendazole this is all about what that is that is mebendazole just i am having a quick review about this uh, mebendazole uh, that is belongs to the helminthetic category and heterocyclic uh, subcategory that have a benzimidazole and carbamate uh, functional group as well as a ring system it is uh, mechanism action irreversibly block the glucose uptake which results uh, subsequently die of parasite and uses broad spectrum enthalpic uh, it is used for the uh, different uh, nematode inf uh, infection that may be lymph worm pin worm round worm hook worm contraindicated in pregnancy due to the teratogenic effect in the use uh, synthesis benzoyl derivative uh, undergo the by uh, nitration by mean of mixture of hno3 and h2so4 that nitro derivative nitro group will be uh, reduced in next step but before uh, chloro chloro is replaced by um, uh, amino group uh, by mean of ammonia that is amino group nitro group reduced to the amino group this and both amino di di amino derivative di amino derivative condense with the this vanadine or thio ether derivative and for which you the mebendazole and that mebendazole have a carbamate form this is the ipc name methyl 5 benzoyl 2 benzimidazole carbamate that is the ipc name of drug molecule okay now in the university exam have a subject to type of question two type of question as i have told generally i told that is the right shot not 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 on the mebendazole and that situation you have to produce all things it means that is starting from the heading uh, the heterocyclic benzimidazole carbamate and mechanical action uses and, and this teratogenic uh, and at the same time synthesis of mebendazole okay and then next is, uh, another one the write the synthesis of mebendazole in that time you have to produce only the synthesis of mebendazole okay in competitive exam there there are the certain uh, mechanism that is related to that maybe say uh, mechanism action and then broad spectrum and uses and the teratogenesis i mean to say whatever i have written to the board that is completely subject object to type of questions uh, answer uh, okay this is all about the mebendazole clear